and how we okay. doing? We've got Chris Chris on from uh, Liaison College. How are we doing today? We are doing fantastic, Bruce. Thanks for having me. Uh, yeah, good. Who else we got there? You said you got somebody else teaming around. You want to just give them a quick shout I, out there? I have a special guest here with us, our event chef, Chef Joanne. Say hi, Chef Joanne. Hi, Bruce. How are you? <laughs> hi, Chef Joanne. How are you? <laughs> uh, I know you, you were thrown into this, so uh, it's okay. Don't worry, we won't ask any hard questions. <laughs> but, but we do have some people on here. I just got to mention some of the people we got hanging on on uh, Facebook here. We got Robert Mayer Jr., who's from Burlington. Uh, Steve Dibodeau's from Burlington. And, oh, Robert's on three times. I think that means Robert wants all the meals. So we got a special announcement today from uh, the wonderful people over at Liaison College in Hamilton, where they yeah. treat teach people how to uh, have careers in culinary arts, liaisonhamilton.ca. So tell us what you guys do over there, Christine. Give us the lowdown on what's going on over there. Well, the lowdown at what's going on at Liaison Hamilton is that we take a person's passion for cooking and help them turn it into a career. For example, we have a flight attendant who is now our event chef. Her name is Chef Joanne. She has a passion for cooking. Ten years ago, she started a small catering company then went into flight attending. Guess what? She has no job. WestJet is not flying yet. So we now have our own personal event chef through Chef Joanne, who's going to be taking on our project that Liaison College is going to be participating in with you, Bruce. You are our first Chef Joanne project. All right, all right. I, I am a project. I will war, warn you, Chef Joanne. I am a project. All right. So we have an, a big announcement. I've uh, made people wait. People are online for this. We're actually streaming on uh, Facebook at the same time that we are um, doing this. So tell us uh, what the big uh, Easter giveaway, Easter feast giveaway is, if I got the right terminology. <laughs> What's going to happen for your listeners Bruce, is that Liaison College, in conjunction with Culinary Occasions, which is Chef Joanne's company, is going to be preparing an Easter feast, an Easter turkey feast for two lucky winners. This will include the whole turkey, all of the sides, appetizer, and dessert. Mm. So this will be available for pickup. On April 1st? Yes. Under your direction, Bruce? Okay, so here... Yeah, here's... Part, the, but we're going to have a fantastic feast that some lucky winner is going to be able to provide for their family or friends over on Easter or whichever day they choose you, to have it. You, you know how important that is because not only in the pandemic are there a lot of people who need food uh, to begin with, um, but this is a great way. We've all been stuck inside. We haven't been able to see anybody. And even though we may not be able to get together even this Easter, I know it was a year ago that we started this. This is kind of a nice way to celebrate because you're talking all the trimmings. You're not just talking, hey, you're going to get a, a frozen turkey in your car as you go by. You're talking, you're cooking oh, it, the sides, everything, oh. right? talking the sides we're talking the gravy or the sauce as we call it in the culinary world there is no such thing as gravy although my mother still calls it gravy but we're also going to be providing some special easter treats for the kids oh, in nice. case or you can give it to your you know crazy uncle victor just those kids candies so okay. we're going to be making easter treats also that are going to be included in this dinner i wasn't going to do a spoiler alert like that but just so you know, there's going to be lots of extras included in this beautiful turkey dinner. You can even choose whether you would like the whole bird as a presentation piece or would you like it carved up beautifully so you can not have any work to do at home and just serve the food. That's the cool thing. People don't actually have to do anything. I mean, Nothing. come on, guys. Nothing. This is the time now, guys, to 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 get up. You you have a chance. If you missed Valentine's Day, if you didn't do Christmas right, you now have a chance to make your wife very happy by telling her you are handling dinner. <laughs> That's the best <laughs> way to do it. <laughs> That's a great way to do it, Bruce. Absolutely. <laughs> For sure. Okay. So here's how people can get involved in this. Uh, first, okay. of, first of all, uh, you do not have to be a fan club member to, although fan club members, please uh, feel free to, to uh, get involved, but you do not have to be a fan club, fan club member 
to uh, to be involved. All you have to do, go to leadpedalradio.com and you will see the Easter Feast giveaway. It's under the contest tab and you can actually go right now. It's already set up. We'll be promoting it more. I want the announcement to come out first. But what you yeah. do is you just... You, it's just basically a little form to fill out your, your name and email and your phone. And then um, we're asking you what six items that you would see on a, on a Easter table. Uh, so be the turkey. We already give it. It's very easy. We, we, we didn't want anybody not to get into. So everybody that registers for that, okay, keep in mind that you do have to pick this up in Hamilton, Ontario. So if you're in uh, Argentina, this may not work for you. But if you're in uh, Southern Ontario, this will probably be fun for you. And we're drawing two winners. We're drawing one on um, the 19th of March and one on the 26th of March. Uh, I believe... Um, you guys are going to be involved helping me out with that draw as well. I'm not sure who you've got uh, got, in, got ready to go with that, but I think uh, we're going to have some people on there as well, right? Yes, we are. We're certainly yeah. available to do that. It'll be an exciting time for us. Yeah. So everybody puts their name in. Just keep registering. It'll go into a list. And then at the end of uh, when we're ready to do the draw, we're going to draw one name. And then the next Friday, we're going to draw another name. We're going to do it all on the all request lunch. So make sure you uh, join us here. There are going to be two Fridays that we do it. So you can get in today. This is a great way. And uh, you're actually able to even uh, re-gift it. So if you don't need the turkey dinner, but, and you know, maybe you got a neighbor down the street that actually can use this, uh, you know, and, and hasn't had a turkey dinner. Maybe you've already got your set or whatever. This is a great way of helping out everybody you just pick it up and it's already cooked and way to go so easter is done for a couple people who ever want to get involved and it's dinner for six dinner for six so if you're dinner. only two or three you can share with the house next door <laughs> you can call me and i'll like do a drive-by <laughs> just throw I the lights <laughs> fantastic yeah, maybe just throw the dark meat at my my as I go by. Just throw the dark meat Eat on your side of, of the of the dish. Yeah, yeah, for sure. That's well. That's an amazing, amazing giveaway. Uh, thank you so much to Liaison College for doing this because that yeah. is a lot of money, preparation, all of that kind of stuff. Uh, it's part of your mandate from the school. It's a nice way yeah. of, and you guys are all part of uh, our station as well. So this is a nice way of us giving a giveaway. So that's going to be the fan club draws. Uh, although you don't have to be in the fan club to do it, this is going to be, we're not doing any fan club draws in March. We're only doing this giveaway. So this is uh, something you really want to pay attention to. We will keep it going. You'll see it on social media and everything. But I just wanted to let everybody know, for those of you that got on the Facebook, you know what's going on, and that's great. Thank you so much for, uh, for joining us today, Chris. Oh, it has absolutely been my pleasure, and I'm hoping that we can do more in the future with Chef Joanne, who's got some fantastic... Yes. South African dishes she would like to share. Ooh. That is third. Once a week, how we do like Meatloaf Tuesday, yep. they have Foodie Monday. She'd like to share that maybe on Friday or whenever you'd like her to do that. Bruce. When, whenever, whenever you want to share food tips, I'm in, and I think most of my friends are in too because that's something that's really, uh, really. Well. We got a lot. Of, we've got a lot of people sitting around at lunch here because I see tons of numbers on Facebook here. So that's uh, that's good that everybody's getting involved. So I think this is awesome. This is our Easter giveaway. I know we got people listening all over. Uh, so I wanted this to be the time, and uh, I think this is going to be great. I, I I'm a, I'm excited, and I can't even get in it because I'm the station owner. Apparently, there's this. Station owner, I'll <laughs> I might have to get a, a turkey done on the side. I might have to get you to cook me a chicken. <laughs>